Melbourne, South Australia, in the beautiful city of Adelaide, world famous for some magnificent cricket matches of all types over the years. Today it plays host the first of a triple header Sunday. It's South Africa against Netherlands, South Africa. They won the toss, Bavuma has decided to bowl first. If they win, they'll go ahead of India. India play later today. Uh, and then, of course, uh, for the Netherlands, they can play the role of spoiler. It would be an upset. We've seen them throughout this World Cup. Do not write them off. They're playing on the same pitch where they beat Zimbabwe just a few days ago. Maxo Dowd, pretty experienced. Good average, excellent strike rate. Myberg, a wealth of experience. Parnell has been outstanding. Left arm, he may just get a bit of movement, early morning movement. We well, shall wait and see. It'll be a handful, as well as pace attack. Pulled away for four. Terrific. Nice bounce there. It was short. It was almost warm-up pace. And Myberg, thank you very much, sir. Good pace. Good pace. It was just away from a man at cover, and it'll race away on that short boundary that short Pollock was talking about this morning, already accessed. In the air and over the back of point. It just teased him. It really was Maharaj there. Again through, teasing those men on the offside. It's off the hip. Direction was poor. Got it again. One bounce four, and that's his sixth boundary, Myberg. And we're only in the fourth over. Straight down the ground again from Myberg. Timing is good. Crunched. O'Dowd this time behind point for four. Swung leg side. He's got the first one. Markram into the attack, picks up a wicket, couldn't quite get aerial enough. Stefan Myberg, and he is the first to fall. Netherlands lose their first one. Stefan Myberg, he's gone for 37. Netherlands, 58 for one. Tom Cooper, the new man at the crease for the Netherlands. Speaking of sixes, rock back, punished. Max O'Dowd with a big one over mid-wicket. And a brilliant shot to start. Cooper not having a sater off the drinks break, straight into action, down on one knee and out of the ground. Oh, that one's down. I think it was hit with some serious power. I think Aidan Markham actually would have thought that it had been whipped through mid wicket rather than straight back to him. This is up. This could be out the ground, a lot of ground trying to be made and it's going to land right in between them all and I think it's going to make its way to the boundary reverse and this time it's played superbly Cooper has middled it oh and it's dropped in the crowd that's beautifully played as well but could be taken I thought it was a little bit wider but that's brilliant nice movement from Kahisa Rabada and he throws the ball back in a little bit of frustration it's been difficult for South Africa but eventually they do get their second. Max O'Dowd, 29 for 31, Netherlands, 97 for 2. Oh, is the next man to the crease, coming in at number 4. Edged and third man is up in the circle, so that will make its way to the boundary. Fortunate boundary for Ackerman. That one's a slog sweep and the placement is superb. Just the one bounce, and that's a nice strike by Cooper. Cooper goes again, but this time the lack of pace means it pops up in the air. Easy catch for Quinton de Kock, and that's a nice way to finish his spell for Kesha Maharaj. He picks up the second, and it's a bit of a blow as Netherlands lose Cooper. Cooper, great penetration. 35 of 19, Netherlands now 1 1 2 for 3. Bustaleta is the new man at the crease. 112 for 3. 5 to go. Slower ball, swung away, leg side, into the gap. And a little fumble. Bold, straight through, genuine pace. Nokia went full, he picks up his first. He's been brilliant this morning here in Adelaide. Netherlands 123 for four. Captain Scott Edwards. Brings that one away, over 
Midon's head down to the boundary for four. Good start to the 19th. Wow, how good's that? That's amazing. Edwards goes again, and that'll be four more. Tried to follow him. So South Africa just getting it wrong at this stage, and Edwards getting it right. as well Smithy I don't think you can see that from your vantage point but that is outstanding he might even be a volunteer is he he's got some accreditation on thrust out the left hand and has pouched it oh, oh another another one Smithy oh same bloke couldn't quite get there this time the seats were in the way get up there and ask him why he didn't dive Smithy please lack 20 of overs gone lack of commitment Simon 100%. 100%. Well, that's it. We're here again from Ian Smith shortly with an interview. 158 for four at the end of their 20 overs. Dirk Nanners, 15 from the last. That is a brilliant end. Plenty to bowl at now from a Netherlands point of view. 158 on the board. Myberg got them off to a good start. That partnership with O'Dowd was 58. Cooper was uh, very aggressive in his 35 off 19. Fine innings from Ackham, and we wanted more from that Dutch middle order. Today, or this morning, they have delivered somewhat. Edwards, a good little finish for the skipper. 159 off the 120 deliveries, and it's uh, a challenge for South Africa. It is Quinton de Cox, facts and figures. Impressive strike rate, decent average. And Bavuma, who found a little bit of form at the Sydney Cricket Ground against Pakistan uh, three days back. Early aggression, a beautifully played through the cover field by Quinton de Kock. Wonderful timing. Doesn't need a second invitation. It's almost a top tier. Wonderful contact that by Quinton de Kock. That's a bit of a freebie. Slow, over pitched, swinging into the middle of Temba Bavuma's bat, and he doesn't miss out. Gives himself room and he finds the edge. So Quinton de Kock advances, but all he can do is a feather through to the wicketkeeper. The Dutch have got their breakthrough. Netherlands have struck early. Quinton de Kock, he's gone for 13. South Africa are 21 for one. Riley Rousseau, the left-handed South African, to the crease at number three. Swings that one away, leg side, walked across the stumps. One bounce, four. Bowled in, beautiful from Van Makinen. Pavuma goes across and he says straight and full will do. Pavuma gone for 20 off 20 balls. South Africa 39 for two through the power play. Aiden Markram. That threw the offside powerfully for four. Timing impeccable. Full toss. Down towards long on, but underneath the man down there is that Bustelado. It is and into the boundary for four. Yeah, has he got enough of it? I don't think so. I don't think so. What do we know? Shane Watson come around the wicket, pick up the big player, Riley Rousseau. Well played, Brandon Glover. The danger man, he's out for 25 off 19. David Miller to the crease for the South Africans. Oh, there's a half a chance. Gets a hand to it. Sharp chance. Had to dive out left. Nicely worked in the timing. The placement superb. Great shot by David Miller. That's beautifully played. Hits with immense power and the placement straight down the ground means it'll go away for a well-welcome boundary for South Africa. Beautifully struck and placement good again from Aidan Markram. Men's power struck down the ground. Leading edge though, and you can see the frustration for Aidan Markram. A massive wicket, short cover takes the catch, and South Africa lose their fourth. Markram falls 90 for four. He's plenty of experience, does Heinrich Larsen. That's beautifully played. That's dragged away. That'll be a maximum for South Africa. Quality from Klaassen. 
Well, the club's it. It's gone up. Is it going to be safe? Is this the moment? What a catch! What a piece of individual brilliance! Van der Merwe! Goodness me! The passport says he's old. His legs say he isn't. David Miller's gone for 17. South Africa 112 for 5. Wayne Parnell is in at 7. Edge and gone. Another one, I think. Yes, indeed. Nicking a wide one. This is unbelievable from the Netherlands. South Africa are falling down here. They are 113 for 6. That is the end of Wayne Parnell. Ishef Maharaj in at number 8. Yes, number 8. They're running out of resources, South Africa. Now then, another catch in the outfield. Yes, there is! And it's, it's Klaassen. It's the dangerous Klaassen. They're running from everywhere on the Adelaide Oval, the men in orange. And they are celebrating in the crowd. Van Beek takes a good catch running forward. Klaassen goes. It won't be him today. It's 120 for 7. New player is Kagisa Rabada. Kagisa Rabada at 9, left-hander. That's what he's there for, and that's what he has to do. About to pull off a major one again. Yes! No! Down! Down, down! It won't cost them the game. But it's only a single, that's why. Could be out. Is out! Is out, Max O'Dowd. And Maharaj, finally the pain will be over as he limps back off the Adelaide Oval. Yeshav Maharaj, unfortunately he stumbles off the crease, 13 of 12, South Africa 141 for 8. Here we go, last ball. Thrashes away. They'll get a boundary to end it. But look at the reaction on the field, they're coming from all over the place. There is so much emotion on the faces of the Dutch fans and their players. They can't quite believe what they have just achieved.